Discover NAB Show, the ultimate destination for media, entertainment and technology professionals. Explore innovation and connect with industry leaders right here in Las Vegas. So Oscar, here we are, day two of NAB 2025. How's the show going so far? Show is going great. We had uh, we had a lot of people come. Uh, day one was a flood of people getting to the booth, and uh, yeah, we're seeing a lot of interest in our solutions and uh, a lot of excitement. So uh, pretty good so far. Thank you. Fantastic. There's absolutely a buzz here on your stand, I can see. Very exciting. So talk to me about Ross. How are you positioned in the broadcast and media industry? Well, we've been uh, we've been at this for a very long time. Uh, this year marks our 51st anniversary, uh, which is good. So we've been, uh, we've been trying to understand our customers, figuring out what their needs are, and make sure that we, that we listen and that we provide solutions that meet their challenges, whether they are business, creative, or technical. So we tend to play in multiple areas of the market, so from tier one customers, broadcasters, production houses, but we also play in uh, beyond broadcast. So we have a big business in sports and live events, Stadia, uh, we have a lot of sports broadcasters, and we also work with the corporate AV market as well, education, house of worship, and a few others. So we tend to have a very broad perspective, and our solutions reach customers across the, across the whole media universe. You are diversified across multiple markets. What are you seeing unfolding in terms of trends in the industry? What are you doing to meet the demands of those trends? Well, there are, there are a few things going on. So on the one hand, I think uh, perhaps the buzzword is AI. Uh, there's a lot of AI. We have, um, we have a team at Ross that is actually only thinking AI and how can we leverage it to bring more power and more impact to the productions that our customers do. So uh, AI is important to us, and we have AI on multiple products at Ross, from our MAM to our robotics and, uh, and a few other products as well. So AI is, is one and is big, and I think the market is trying to understand how do, they, how do they use it to become more efficient. So we're on that ride with our customers. Um, I think the other, the other trend is perhaps uh, IP. We support all IP protocols. Uh, we play in 2110, we play in NDI. And, uh, and many other formats that are constantly being uh, reshaped. Uh, so yeah, so IP, very important trend that we're riding with our customers. And uh, cloud, we're launching our new cloud provisioning system here to make, to make the, whole, uh, the whole setup deployment of uh, cloud environments easier for our customers. And can you talk to me a little bit about what you're showcasing here this year at NAB? Well, yes, we have absolutely everything we do, right? We have a massive booth. Uh, we have over 40 demo pods uh, on the booth. So we are, we have a massive portfolio, as I think you know. Uh, maybe if I focus on what's new, Hypermax is a, it's an exciting production system that simplifies production with licenses that can shift and change to the needs of the customer. Then we have uh, Artimo, so Artimo uh, was launched recently. We have now a white Artimo, um, and, uh, and we have some advancements in that, in that product too. And then beyond that, uh, we have Spidercam flying on the booth, which is attracting a lot of interest to, uh, for our customers. So can you tell me about any other developments that you have unfolding right now? Uh, yes, so one of the things that we're showing that is very cool is our live production center where what we're demonstrating is that by integrating a number of raw solutions within a one rack, we can create essentially all you need to run a studio. It's very powerful, it plays to our interest in sustainability, and of course it also saves power, efficiency, cables, and, uh, and cost for our customers. So Oscar, tell me, what does the future look like for Ross? Well, I think the future is gonna be bright, but it's gonna be defined by the needs of our customers they keep evolving, we're going to make sure we listen and we continue to support them and provide solutions for them like we've done for the last 51 years. Well, congratulations on your 51st anniversary and I'm wishing you a brilliant show here at NAB 2025. Thank you very much, Kayla. Thanks.